With Tecla EPM 2020, we've improved the way you can track internal and external stations and routes. If I go to maintenance, production control, stations and routes setup, we now see that there's a type field next to the station that indicates whether it's a production station, which means it's internal to your, one of your shops, or a field station, which means it's an external process such as erection. In this case, I've set up a field station called receive on site and erected, and I've added it to my stations and routes. What that looks like in production control, when I go to a job that has that particular route added and go to review production status, we see that I now see all those internal stations, and in this case, sequence one has been completed through cut, fit, weld, QC, so the production status is complete. It's also been loaded and shipped to the job site. Um, but here I see that uh, it's been received on site, but not erected. So it shows that a separate field status is in progress. What that looks like in the model view, if I go side by side here, if I look at the shipping status and colorize, I see that sequence one has been received on site. I now have a, a new visualization, which is field status. And when I hit colorize, it's been received on site, but it hasn't been erected yet. So I'm going to pull over EPM Go and I'm going to go in this particular project to production tracking. And I'm going to do an add batch to that erection station. And I'm going to make sure that I'm filtered by sequence one. And I'm going to hit max quantity and update. So it's going to take everything in sequence one and update it through that erection station. It takes a moment to update and then it disappears from the list. And I'll clear my filter. And when I go to the production status, which is the same, um, is available in EP Go, EPM Go the same way it would be in EPM, we now see that it's been received on site and it's been erected and that status went to complete for my field status.